I had so much fun. I learned so many great things and met amazing people that I wanted to come back again. GovHack promotes the economic, social and environmental value of open data to develop and address public policy and service delivery challenges, while also upskilling the participants of our expanding digital economy as they move into the new jobs of today and tomorrow. This event is all about people solving the world's problems by using government data to solve some of the big wicked problems that are out there that need to be solved. How do we um, evolve ourselves from uh, the pandemic that has just hit us and how do we evolve ourselves in terms of mental well-being? There is an excellent challenge around those who are on the autis autistic spectrum. It runs over 46 hours through the weekend uh, where you need to create some tangible um, output out of uh, the information and the challenges which is provided to you and come together uh, you know with some ideas and thoughts uh, create a presentation and then bring everything to life it's a great way of using young minds and excited minds and brilliant innovative minds to come up with great solutions by opening government data sets to them over a long weekend so there's three kinds of people you can have at a hackathon there's hackers, so engineers and techies like me. There's hustlers who are looking at the business problem solving side and hipsters who are looking at the design and the way things really look and feel. I think I'm most excited about this GovHack being blended and that there are people online and there are people physically here so that we're going to have some groups that are working in the online space doing more with digital questions and digital issues and also people here will have that exciting buzz of working here. Definitely looking forward to hopefully coming up with something that can be used. That is good. They've used you know uh, numerous uh, prototypes or you know wireframes and so on. But then bringing everything together in something which is presentable for them to actually shoot and speak through in three minutes. It's a good uh, way to actually <clears throat> represent and information coming out from there uh, to then be able to use it for the greater good. It makes sense for this event to be held here because Torrance is about adding value and adding value in a way that is also doing good. It shows how we're working with the local industry, with the local government and working on some of those bigger problems that need to be solved where we don't necessarily have the solutions. So it really blends in with our social enterprise hub and all the work we're trying to do there. We have seen you know, a lot of times uh, people have come in and, uh, you know, presented some great ideas. Some of the government departments have offered them internships. Some of them have actually gone ahead to work with the sponsors or some other sponsoring agency. I especially uh, came to participate here. I, I, I need these kinds of experiences. And it's going to help me in my career. We firmly believe that all of our students are not just studying us with us for a qualification, it's, it's to get them job ready, to get them um, the employability skills that will carry them through into their future. So these sorts of real world scenarios that are posed to them are things that, that uh, you know, they'll have to deal with once they graduate. Um, I wanted to come here, meet new people, network and um, learn and educate myself. I wanted to be part of like a better South Australia. With GovHack, you're learning about open data and different data sets, um, and that is just really irreplaceable experience. Um, the things that I've done at hackathons actually have helped me get the jobs that I've had um, since university. So definitely, definitely a really good thing for universities to be part of. You build connections, you learn life skills, and it's, it's, it's a great uh, 46 hours, it's a weekend well spent. <laughs>